Hi there, welcome back to the next video. And in this video, let's create a line chart. And uh, if you have uh, previously created the line chart, you would know that line chart is especially useful in showing the trend. And trend is shown on the over the period of time. So let's go into edit mode and uh, let's delete this. And to create a line chart, let's take the line chart over here. Um, let's add a dimension. So for order date, let's add month and let's add a measure which is sum of sales. So we have Jan, Feb, March up until December. We have the different month and uh, let's add one more dimension which is uh, uh, let's say in each year we want to see how the sales are coming. So once I click on done, here is a, a line chart which is clearly indicating when the ups and downs are happening and over a period of time whether the sales is reducing or sales is increasing. So 2009 is basically your red line, yellow line and this is little hard but you, what you can do is click over here and uh, it will clearly show you what kind of line it is. So I can clearly see that okay this is a blue line and over here you have the green line. So that's how you can even highlight it. So let me cross this because I don't want it that value. So I now clearly see that 2010 indicate this, this, this particular line. So this, this basically shows me the trend over a period of time. Now, like I said, uh, that you can change the colors and appearance. Let's see the appearance section over here because that plays a lot of, uh, a role so two things you can create a line chart as well as you can create an area chart so both the charts you can create from this section and if you see it starts showing you the different uh, options so stack area how it how you want to show the stack area like this or a different way like this a different stack area for different one and couple of other properties but let's keep on the uh, keep ourselves on the line chart and uh, over here it is showing us the different properties again i will focus on the colors uh, it allows us to i have just uh, removed the color and now the single color is coming but i as you know i can choose by the dimension or i can choose by the expression based on what my need is so so it, it basically allows us to choose from the different colors but for now, I think I'm good with what was shown earlier. I think this is pretty enough as compared to what is given to me. Uh, then you have uh, the x-axis and y-axis values on which you can change the properties and make it a little bit different if you have a need. But mainly I will show you how basically you want to create it and the option like how you can convert a normal line chart into an area chart so that uh, if uh, you want to play around and want to see whether line chart is not something what you need but the area chart and area chart is not given over here you should know that it is a part of the line chart so that's pretty much it about uh, the line chart in this video and i will meet you in the new video a new topic